Mark's UMC. My name is David Woodford. I'm the Communications and Youth Director here at St. Mark's. And it's been a while. Uh, there's a there's a brief moment in time in which uh, I stopped doing these. And uh, I think I owe you all an explanation. Really, uh, life's just been kind of chaotic recently. And it's very ironic because we were about to start um, Job. We, uh, if you recall last episode, we were about to start talking about Job. And um, I, had, I had done the preamble and I had said, all right, we're gonna be talking about Job. Here's what we're gonna be doing. And uh, then uh, life hit. My wife got way more sick and uh, the episode that we recorded ended up being unusable because my little microphone here flipped inside my shirt and all you heard was it was just really bad. And uh, you know, in the meantime, uh, I started up the podcast, which if you haven't listened, uh, we just posted uh, an episode with Donna Riley. It was a lot of fun. It was really exciting. So go check that out. Um, so we're still making stuff here. But it had been a while since, uh, or it has been a while, since I've done a, uh, a little lesson. So we're going to be going through the book of Job. Um, if you're following along at home, uh, I'm just going to be talking about chapter one. So if you haven't read the book of Job, pause this video right now and go read this chapter because this is really important. So um, one of the things about Job, ironically enough, is coping with tragedy how to deal with it. Um, this speaks to me a lot in my own personal life, as some of you know. Uh, this past year, you know, 2021 has been really difficult for me. On top of the fact that 2020 and 2021 have been difficult for everyone in general, uh, I've had a lot of added stressors. And so um, if you've paused and read chapter one, you'll already know that Job is going through difficult times. And, uh, He's going through stuff that's the most difficult to go through. I think that it's important to note that I don't think much worse things could happen to Job. And in chapter two, we're going to get into some of the worst things. But essentially, between chapter one and chapter two, Job is going to go through it all. And uh, I, that's important because it lets us know what the appropriate response is when we're going through it. And I want to read that real quick. In verse 22, it says, Throughout all this, Job did not sin or blame God for anything. Feeling chaos and feeling, uh, you know, these hard times in life. Feeling upset, feeling vulnerable. And, uh, you know, depression, all this stuff. This is natural. These feelings are normal. I'm saying that to me as much as I'm saying it to you. But the, the thing is that we don't blame God at the end of the day. Because God is there to help us. This isn't some kind of, you know, he's not doing this to us. The whole point of the story is he's not even doing this to Job. So, as we go through the book of Job, I want you to be thinking about that that as tragedy ensues, that as tragedy happens to us, as it will happen to all of us, that we keep our eyes on the prize and we continue to worship and praise God throughout even the hardest of times. That's the encouragement of the book of Job. And that's the encouragement that I'm giving you today. I just wanna thank you all for being here. And we're gonna be posting more episodes of this next week and uh hopefully we've returned to our normal schedule and we've also got the podcast coming up uh you know we're gonna do that every week so continue to tune in and uh thank you for listening god bless <laughs>